Hi everyone, The Simple Dad here. In this video, I'll show you how to remove the navigation bar on your Samsung S25 Ultra. So Samsung lets you remove the old navigation buttons here and switch it to a full screen swipe gestures. So you can swipe up to go home, swipe and hold for recent apps and swipe from the sides to go back. So let me show you how to do this first. So here we have the old layout where you have the recent apps, home and back. We'll go ahead and open up settings. Scroll down into display. Here, find navigation bar. So from here, we'll go ahead and choose swipe gesture. Now to use swipe gesture, you have three ways. So to go back to home, just go ahead and swipe up. This will take you to home. If you want to open up the recent apps, just go ahead and swipe up and hold it there. And this will open up your recent apps. If you want to go back, go ahead and swipe from the side and this will take you to the back. So as you can see, you maximize from screen space for a cleaner look. It makes multitasking faster and more smoother, and it gives your phone a modern iPhone-like gesture experience, only better though. So there you go, guys. That is how to turn on navigation gestures on your Samsung Galaxy device. If you're new on the channel and you want to find out more about your iPhone, your Android phone, or any other social media apps, then don't forget to subscribe to this channel to become a part of the Simple Dad community. Hit the like button if you find this video useful.